Laracon EU 2025 in Amsterdam was the stage for the Laravel core team to announce a series of significant and new initiatives, signaling what Taylor Ortwell calls a new era for the PHP framework. With a laser focus on developer productivity and streamlined experience, Laravel is positioning itself as the obvious choice for modern web application development. And these announcements aren't just incremental, they represent a cohesive vision for the future of Laravel development from local environment to large scale deployments. The headlining announcement was undoubtedly the unveiling of Laravel Cloud. This platform aims to abstract away the complexities of infrastructure management, allowing developers to focus on solely building applications. Taylor highlighted the goal of enabling deployment from local development to production in under a minute, a game changer for rapid iteration and time to market. Laravel Cloud boasts zero configuration requirements and no environment variables to manage, significantly lowering the barrier to entry. The platform enables easy scaling of applications, databases, caches, queues, with customizable auto-scaling settings. Laravel Cloud provides tools for issuing artisan commands, viewing logs, and monitoring application metrics like edge network responses, CPU, and RAM usage. They're offering a sandbox plan with no fixed monthly fee alongside the production plan, so it will cater for a wide range of products. New starter kits were also announced, with Laravel Breeze and Jetstream being unified into a single starter kit, offering options for React, Vue, or Livewire. And these new kits leverage modern UI libraries. This move simplifies the initial project setup, allowing developers to quickly dive in build features with pre-configured modern stacks. Laravel 12 is here. In a commitment to stability, Laravel 12 aims to be a major update without introducing breaking changes. This ensures that existing Laravel applications can be seamlessly upgraded without requiring code modifications. While we're still waiting to see exactly what this looks like, this release will demonstrate focus on backwards compatibility and a smooth upgrade path for the Laravel ecosystem. Inertia JS has also been acquired by Laravel, a library that allows developers to build full stack applications using React and Vue for the front end powered by Laravel for the back end. This new acquisition signals a new partnership with Inertia.js and Laravel into the deeper ecosystem, promising enhanced support for further development of this popular library. And one that I'm really excited for, Laravel Nightwatch. First unveiled a little while ago in Australia, Nightwatch is a new application for monitoring. It offers insights into behavior, performance, and everything you need to know for how your application is running. And lastly, there's the VS Code extension. To cater for the number of growing developers using VS Code, the official Laravel VS Code extension is nearing stable release. This extension provides features such as IntelliSense, code navigation, and autocomplete, offering a much more seamless and productive development experience. These announcements highlight a strategic direction for Laravel, focusing on developer experience, streamlining development workflow for experienced developers. Taylor Ortwell challenged the community on stage to continue shipping. Laravel will continue providing the streamlined development experience that empowers us to bringing our ideas to life to make the internet better than we left it. The announcements at Laracon EU were huge, and I'm so excited to see what they're going to announce on stage in America in a few months' time.